Okay, this time we are looking at the Bullet Premier 31 REPR. It's the Reaper. All right, let's check this thing out. Nice solid step entry. Here we go. Ooh, you got your nice. Nice colors. They're okay, very yeah, very light, um, which is standard for your keystones nowadays. Flip it around here, Teresa. You know, walk us through the kitchen. Here's your like pantry cupboard. Yeah. Pretty good size. Look at that. Are they are they soft clothes? No. Nope. Okay. Nice size refrigerator. Got Furion appliances, Furion microwave, oven. stove and oven. Oh, and here's another one of those big drawers underneath. Oh, I like that. Big drawers, not the little. I love this sink. Now, if I was going to do anything different, I would keep this sink and put a divider right here. Now, a divider that didn't go all the way down so that the water, you only needed one drain. Oh. That's what I would do. But anyway, you got a nice 50 inch TV, storage. fireplace, storage. Storage is backlit? Yeah. Yeah. Whoa. Nice. And you've got storage up there, but you've got your little. Okay, so that is a great touch right there. Yep. Having little end tables yep. with all of your USB and your outlets and it's a keystone so you've got at least 200 watts of solar up on the roof so you've got your inverter outlets right here anything with the yellow sticker on it is going to be an inverted outlet so when the power goes out you're still watching uh, your favorite uh, chicago cub baseball team oh and look at these cup holders these can hold the bigger water bottles that's nice yeah that's very nice yep so thomas Payne furniture love got, that and you've got more usb I, I love all the windows in this space oh and look they've got each have an arm um yeah storage good size table oh, i like that seats four comfortably all right let's go check out the bedroom all right oh hey this thing is prepped for washer dryer right there i thought this was just a nice cubby hole hey. that you could just kind of play hide and seek with the grandkids in but no this thing's prepped for uh washer dryer got a nice chest of drawers right here you've got some nice shelving down here for like oh, sweatshirts yeah. and stuff there you go and you got a closet over yeah. here watch this it's got it's got adjustable shelving oh see now yeah. Now this is the kind of stuff that I mean RVers ask for all the time and they're putting it in this rig and then you've got your nice sliding closet here. Wow that thing is spacious. You could put a couple grandkids in there. <laughs> yeah they could travel with you in there. Yeah, I would put a shoe rack in there and then have plenty of room for hanging and they put the middle support bar in there which is so smart yeah so and then a nice shelf above here and then storage above your sleeping area yeah. very nice very nice uh ducted ac you've got venting yeah. nice yeah. barn style door for the bedroom let's check out the bathroom ah sorry All right. Okay. Nice size shower unit right there. You got your venting sink. Plenty of cabinetry for your towels and your toilet paper and whatnot. Really nice. Your control panel is right up here. So you've got two slide outs and one awning. So these are opposing slides right here. That's a slide and that's a slide, a, which really just opens this space up. There's another awning. Why is there two awnings? Okay, so the mystery was you got two awnings on this deal. You've got one out here in your kind of camp living space 
And then you've got another one that's on the slide out right here. So that extends your living space out a little bit. We in the campground, that's a great idea. Okay, let's take a look at the outside of this thing. So you've got storage that's gonna be under your bed here. Uh, that's your furnace. All right, so that's just a really quick look at the uh, Bullet Premier REP, the Reaper. Check it out. It's a nifty little uh, travel trailer. Um, you know, we're into the fifth wheels, but if we had to go back into a travel trailer, this would be on the list. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. A little bit bigger. All right. We'll see you in the next one.